Hello, I'm Dr. Syed Yunus. I'm an implantologist and I've been working in Cosmodet, Bangalore. Yes, he can. A patient is classified as a diabetic if the fasting blood glucose level is constantly above 140 mg per deciliter. A fasting blood glucose level of below 200 mg per deciliter is usually considered safe for minor oral surgical procedures including extractions. However, being diabetic makes you prone to a lot of infections and has a poor effect on the wound healing capacity of the body. Hence, it is mandatory to have an adequate amount of uh, broad spectrum antibiotic coverage before and after your dental extraction. Also, a constant and optimum level of blood glucose levels have to be maintained, so don't skip your insulin or any other oral hypoglycemic medications prescribed by your doctor. A pre-operative blood glucose evaluation will be required by your dentist. Also, if possible, a morning appointment schedule for your dentist would be ideal. Being a diabetic doesn't mean you're completely excluded from any kind of dental treatment or you have to shy away from going to a dentist. You can always get your regular checkups done, your scalings and restorations and fillings done without any hassle. But for slightly more complex and invasive procedures like your gingival flap surgeries or your implant procedure, uh, there are a few things that you have to keep in mind and uh, these are things that you have to keep in check. The first one is your random blood sugar, an RBS test would be required. The second one would be your HbA1c, below 7 is what is ideal. And uh, the third and the key element is to be in constant touch with your dentist. Keep coming for follow-up, schedule appointments and request a dentist for every month appointments and they will gladly oblige. And if anything does go wrong, we always uh, are there to help you out and monitor it.